guys welcome back to my channel so this is your first time viewing one of my videos my name is Elle Morgan and I post fashion lookbooks DIYs hacks lifestyle videos vlogs other fun stuff like that so make sure you subscribe to this channel and click that notification bell so you know when you girl upload a video because I'm your best friend in your head if you didn't already know Okay, so for today's video, I wanted to show you guys a couple of things that I have been thrifting. I've been going to the thrift store over the course of like a couple months here and there. And these are the pieces that I've collected throughout those trips. I only have six pieces. Um, like I said, I haven't been finding like a whole lot, so it's not like a ton of stuff. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video. Before I start showing you guys stuff that I got I want to talk about this hoodie that I'm wearing that is super cute I know you guys noticed it like where can I get one I'm about to tell you you can see it says mother hustler established 2018 because I had baby girl last year I ordered this hoodie from a company um, I'm going to put it here um, across the screen and they have different little like mother type of stuff like that this isn't a sponsored video i just want to give this company a shout out but they have um like different mother type of stuff like that and i'll post like little examples of what they have on the site but i really really love this one i thought it was super cute it has like where you can customize to establish like when you you know had your kid and all that stuff so i thought it's really really cute and it has like the bell sleeve for the um the hoodie so it's not like your basic crop hoodie so it's a little bit different it's like the flare sleeve and then it has like the hood of course on it and it's actually my cousin's company so i wanted to give her a shout out she actually is having a sale on her site right now so i think it's like 20 percent off um all items on there so you can get this discounted so yeah go check her out and like i said you can customize this and she has other things on there that you can customize it's pretty cool so make sure you go ahead and check her out and check out her instagram and tell her that i sent you so yeah on to the video the first piece i want to show you guys actually untied it so let me tie that back so this top here is by top shop and this was really cute i actually got it for like two dollars because goodwill was having that half off thing you know if you if it was like blue ticket or how whatever color it was i don't remember but it has like this little bell sleeve kind of a ruffle sleeve i mean cuff here super cute and it has this ruffle detail around the collar and it ties in the back and i'm going to try this on so you guys can see it as well but I thought this was really cute and it's by Top Shop, so like that's a really I think this is really cute to like dress up or like kind of do like a casual dressy look because this would be really cute with like some high waist jeans and like some heels or something like that. All right, my next top here is a button down and it's like a see-through material here, which is actually kind of sexy, cute, classy, sexy, you know what I mean? So with this, I probably would just wear like, to be honest, I probably wear like a really nice bra with this. Yeah, I probably wouldn't wear a camisole, depending on where I was wearing it. If I was wearing it out or something like that, I probably would just wear a really nice bra underneath this with some, I don't know, with, it depends. I don't know, cause like you can kind of do a lot with this. Like I could do like a fitted skirt or something like that or like some jeans. Or however, more likely I probably will tie it up because you know that's how I like to wear my button downs. I don't think I would try to like wear out the shoulder just because of the material. I don't think it would work well with it. It's a little bit too stiff for that. So, um, but yeah, I probably would wear it buttoned up with like something that was high waist. But yeah, again, I really like this. They also had it in a blue, but then I thought like the blue, I didn't want to get two of the same kind of shirt like it was exactly the same but just blue but sometimes I kind of think about it and I'm like I probably should have got it because that blue was popping yeah I messed up okay so for my last top this is actually like it's wrinkled I haven't steamed it or anything yet because I haven't actually worn it yet but this is a like satin is it satin oh no it's polyester um it's polyester button down like soft 
old blouse. It's a little bit big, so it's slightly oversized, but it has like the button detail here with the collar. I really like this because I like the fact that it had that satin, silky type of look, and I thought that that would be good for like another casual, dressy look, like a little date night or like girls night, kind of chill, going to go get some drinks. You know, I want to kind of dress it up a little bit, but not too much. I feel like this is kind of like the perfect blouse for that. And I think pairing it with like a denim kind of makes it casual or whatever. And then have like some sexy heels or something with that. I think that would be a really cute little look right there. I think that would be a look. And I am going to do a lookbook of the pieces that I'm showing here on how I style like thrifted items and stuff i've done something like that before on my channel but i'll be doing that again so you guys can see how i style those shirts especially so now on to the end so i got some just high-waisted denim jeans these are by lee and they are a little bit big initially when i bought them they did fit but i am breastfeeding still and stuff so i've gotten a little bit smaller but I am in the gym now, so I'm working on getting my gains. So I feel like I am going to gain weight again. So yeah, so they'll fit even better. I feel like by the summertime or whatever. But yeah, but these I got in a size, I think these were like a six. But you know, it doesn't even really matter with these sizes because a lot of these are like vintage. So stuff that they made back then are cut way differently than they are now. Yeah, this is an eight pillar denim jean here. Kind of like a mom jean. I actually like to wear this type of stuff with like crop tops and stuff like that. I think it's a really cute look. So that's kind of like one of my casual looks that I like to wear. So yeah, these are perfect for that. These I am actually really excited about because I can't hardly ever find anything like these. These are white like dress pants and they're actually lined. Hello. You can hardly ever find any white pants that are lined. So this is definitely a find right here. But yeah, I found these and these are size six. They actually fit pretty good. I think they might be a little bit big, but like I said, they'll fit better by the summertime for me. And they kind of, they have like a straight cut, not really a skinny, but like a straight cut here. I wish it was a little bit more tapered at my leg, but I can live with it. I can always go back and, um, fix that if I wanted to but yeah I really like these and these have like the side zip here with the invisible zipper and all of that and these are kind of like high waist and I am really excited about styling these like and so lastly I found these these are actually brown pants and I haven't purchased anything brown in years like I used to be obsessed with brown like back in the day, like the early 2000s, mid 2000, 2006, something like that. I used to be obsessed with brown. But I found these, and this is actually, I think this is a Macy's brand, Style & Co. But these, baby, <laughs> these fit, okay? They fit, and they're really stretchy, and they're high waist. And like, I couldn't pass them up, and I'm not even a big fan of brown, but the fact of how they fit, I was like, you know what? I could do brown again. I could do it again. Hardly ever have luck with finding like dress pants in a thrift store. And the fact that I've been able to find like two, and especially one of them in white, I'm like, yeah, definitely winning with that. So I hope you enjoyed this thrift haul. Stay tuned for a lookbook showing you guys how I style these items. So make sure you are subscribed and click that notification bell. And don't forget to check the description box below for all my social media networks. And don't forget to check the link to check out my cousin's merch. She has some really dope merchandise over there. So make sure you guys check that out. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.